Say hello to the Google Pixel 6a and the Nothing Phone 1, arguably two of the most anticipated mid-range devices that we've seen in 2022. And for good reason, they offer incredible value and power and performance, but also they have good cameras as well. And so we're gonna be doing a head-to-head -head camera comparison today to see which device takes better photos and videos. So with that, let's jump in. When it comes to the camera hardware, the Nothing Phone 1 does have the advantage here with much newer 50 megapixel sensors for its main and ultra wide cameras on the back that can capture 4K video at 30 frames per second, while the front facing 12 megapixel sensor can capture 1080p video at 30 FPS. As for the Pixel 6a, it has a 12.2 megapixel sensor for its main camera that can capture 4K video at 60 frames per second, and another 12 megapixel sensor for the ultra wide that can capture 4K at 30 FPS, and then an 8 megapixel up front for the selfie camera that maxes out at 1080p 30 FPS. Both of these phones are able to capture 4K video from the rear cameras on the back of the device. The Nothing Phone 1 isn't able to zoom out on the fly while still recording to the ultra wide camera. You're left stuck with that main sensor and if you want to switch you do have to stop recording and start again. And the same goes with the ultra wide camera on these devices. If you want to switch over to that main sensor after starting recording with the ultra wide, you can do that on the Pixel 6a simply by tapping the on-screen button, but there's no option on the Nothing Phone 1. And this here's a look at side-by-side -side video capture from the selfie cameras on these devices. I have to say that the Nothing Phone 1 seems to do a little bit better in these kinds of situations, but it'll be interesting to see how these two perform side by side once lighting conditions aren't as good. When recording outside in direct sunlight, both of the selfie cameras on these two devices do pretty well though. The Pixel device seems to have just a little bit better dynamic range, blowing out fewer of the highlights get from the harsh sun. So outside, the Pixel 6a is better than the
And this here is a good test. And this here is a good scenario as any for testing out the low light performance of the selfie cameras on these two devices, starting off in really pitch black, but then moving close to this light source behind me here. Definitely not the best performance on either of these two devices, but as long as you do have a light source to light up your subject, you should just be fine. for this camera comparison between the Nothing Phone 1 and Google's new Pixel 6a. Let me know what you think of the results in the comments below and which budget or mid-range device you would rather use on a day-to-day -day basis for capturing your photos and videos. I do have full reviews coming up with both of these devices and additional camera comparisons as well. So make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.